currently fighting with a cat to try and get the stream started. Uh, hi, welcome to stream. It's just me today. There's and there's Mama. I don't know if you guys can hear her. She's here. Um, yeah, it's just me. Uh, Cole's in Virginia doing a Smash thing, so I I thought I'd steal a stream. I wasn't gonna stream today, uh, but then I I thought about it and I'm like. This is actually a really good opportunity for me to catch up because uh, Cole is ahead of He's a whole world ahead of me. He's at the final boss of this world uh, currently. Um, so yeah, before we go here though, yeah, Flick Rush. I want to check this out because if it's anything like the um, Birth by Sleep command board, wherein it's going to actually give me items and like help me progress in this game, then... It might not be a bad idea to check out, so uh, let's give it a try. Wait. Oh, it... Oh, it just takes me here? <laughs> I could have selected uh, Traverse Town on the world map and chose the save point, but no, the flick rush option is just an automatic, hey, you're here now. Okay, yeah, sure, 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 sure. Um... Checking right here for Flick Rush. Uh, am I ever? I don't know what this is. Uh, tournament. Uh, oh, it's really wanting me to do tutorials, huh? Perform all tournaments, perform and collect medals to increase your rush level. Pat main character confirmed. I mean, hey, I've done, I've done more solo streams than Cole has of this game as of right now. So, uh, yeah. It's starting to seem seem that way. Also, hello, Will Joe. How you doing? Uh, we're doing Flick Rush. Uh, man, I don't want to have to go through all these. Wait. Oh. Oh. Okay. Select cards with. Is this like Queen's Gambit or whatever in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth? Queen's Blood. Select cards of X to have your spirits attack, or square to have them defend. Reduce the HP of all your opponents to zero. Alright, uh, there. Get them! Cards depletes your action gauge. Okay. Yeah. Uh, duh! Okay. Yeah. So, I play a card, and I attack him, and then when he attacks me, I defend with a higher number than what he's attacking me with. Chain of Memories vibe? Not really. It's not like real time. I mean, there's, there's cards. This game really does like its cards. These cards value will appear above your spirit. Huh? Oh, this is like the the ace. Okay. I mean, it, it's kind of real time. Use two cards in quick success succession. Their values be added together. Oh, so I just got to spam cards. It's literally what it's asking me to do. Okay. So that's why the action gauge goes down so slowly, because it's encouraging you to just spam the heck out of them. The card in quick concession. Defe right, yeah. Thank you. And that can only be used once. Uh-huh. Oh boy. There's so much that I'm assuming is going to be happening, like, all at once. I gotta, now it's a match three game. Sure. Oh, I get it. it. Just oh, I see, I see. And now, oh, I need to wait. Okay. That's very weird. Uh, I mean, if I have to. These tutorials aren't that long, at least, and it's not like it's a bunch of reading. 
because that's what these games really like to do sometimes. Real cards would tag spirits into battle. Okay, yeah, this is like Chain of Memories, because if I hold down Triangle, then the uh, cards reload. Okay. Uh, you. Okay. Is that, that's, that's all, right? Okay, thank God. I want to make some new Pokemons? You, you, you tell me, tell me what you, what you make. That sounds good. All right, uh, training cup. Uh, the, okay, yeah, so it's actually using my, my team, my actual little guys. Uh, so yeah, that sounds good. And we're gonna do it. This is, this is gonna be a thing, it's gonna happen. All right, and go, and go, and do it. I'm just gonna keep adding up the first couple and just play extremely offensively because I don't see why I would need to play defensively if I have a high enough card move that I could just counter all of his attacks with. Did I get him? I got him. Oh. We made the elephant? Dude, I, I want to make the... Oh, sh oh, shoot. We're still going. We're still going. Uh, uh, you. Get in here. All right. Yeah, get him. In order to flop there. Elephant hype. Did he, did he go wowie zowie? I hope he went wowie zowie. Yeah, get him. All right, and 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 finally you, you get him, get him, get him, get him. Yeah, he's rolling. Get him with the heebie flurry. Get him with the heebie jeebies. So I guess okay. So I guess that's why you'd want to defend is if your uh, action meter is running low and you can't really do much. But I mean, we're we're doing good. Oh, it's a duel. Uh, you. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Uh, we're still going, even though I got an achievement. You better give me good. <laughs> oh no! I got it. I got it. I'm dazed. It's the best video game mechanic. All right, get back here. Finish him off. Yeah, get him. Is a rank E? E for elephant, dude. That's what that means. It's an E for Elephant Mario. We win! I bet that deserves a kiss. Huh, I won! You won the training cup. I got a rank A. Hell yeah. Alright, alright, alright. This is not something I want to keep doing. I have 60, I have 60 medals though. I know there's a metal shop. Can I buy stuff? Yeah. Okay. And the, yeah, that's all the, okay. There's not a lot of stuff you can really get from here though. I can't get that cause that's Sora only. Drain HP. That seems worth it. That might seem worth it, but that's a lot of metals, and I don't want to have to keep doing this. I can make them small. Just touching mini foes will deal damage. I mean, that could be useful too, honestly. Not that that could be used against bosses or anything, but... All right, I'll do one more. We'll see if that gives me enough metals to buy something. Uh, yep, 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 am I ever. Switch balloon. I mean, honestly, I I might be tempted to. If if there's absolutely zero way for Riku to get balloons, then uh, then yeah, yeah, I might just do that. <laughs> uh, let me do one more of this. 
and uh, then then I might do that. So I know this game isn't meant to be played with two people like this, so if uh, I can have any advantage, then that might be worth it. Yeah, get him. Get him. Get him. Get him with hit him with a scratch. Hit him with a lunging scratch. Uh, oh, it's a duel. Uh, you. At least they're making these duels really easy for me. Oh, you. Oh, you. Wait, why can't I? Oh, action game. Okay, now now it's actually coming into play. Alright, uh. I wanna keep you out just to finish him off. Get him. Alright, perfect. Now we'll switch. Now we'll switch to you. Hit him with the balloon. Oh, it dazed him. All right, let's go. Oh boy. Uh, vanish. Yeah, you're invisible. He can't see you. Even though knowing where the enemy is isn't really a thing in this mode, but it's fine. But it's fine. My little guy's gonna get him. He's dazed. Now slow. Now slow him down. All right. Oh, he switched. He's not dead yet, but he switched. Oh boy. Oh, he's tough. Oh, he's really tough, actually. Uh, uh, you, 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 you. He's actually giving me high numbers. I. What are you? What are you waiting for, my guy? Okay. Okay. Cool. 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 Burning rubber. That didn't. He didn't even. Okay. Cool. Just, just do it. Do the. Do the stuff. Why are you just standing there? Why are you just standing there? I. For the love of. Okay, buddy. 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 All right. Uh, red rage. Hit him. Hit him with the red rage. Hit him with the chomp. Hit him with the chomp. Okay. Oh my god, what is he doing? What is he doing? Come on. Just kill him. Could do a, do a murder. Alright, I need... Oh, he's bringing this guy back. Oh no, I died. Okay, alright. I... Wait, was that... What happened? I didn't... Did I... Huh? Wait. What? What happened? Did I die or did he? This is way more dramatic than the last win. Oh, I won! I won! I guess? Sure. Rank B, that's fine, I'll take it. Hey Matt, how you doing? Welcome to stream. It's just me today. Uh, no, I don't wanna do the next match. I wanna leave. This probably still isn't enough medals to buy anything, is it? I can, I can buy Drain Dive with exactly this amount of medals. Uh, I assume if I did one more and each match is giving me 60, then I'll have 180, which will only be enough to buy Stop. I can buy this Panda recipe. I mean, if I want to get more guys, then that might be worth it. Uh, why not? I'll do that. All right. Um, that's not what I meant to hit at all. Uh, if I create spirit, these are my recipes, so I can make you. Oh, I can actually make them. Yeah, why not? Why not? Let's do that. Uh. Attack one. In the 3DS version, Flick Rush is multiplayer? Really? I assume because there's a multiplayer mode in, in Chain of Memories on the actual Game Boy. I think, uh, this is all from memory, I could be wrong, but I think if you had like a, like a link cable, you could connect your two Game Boys and you could fight each other 
with whatever deck you had for the actual game, which I think is a really cool idea. That's cool that there's something similar in this, too. Uh, I'm not using Slide and Dash. Let's give that to him. There he is! Oh, he's a little ball! There he is! Alright. Oh boy, what's his name? What is his name? Oh, I have little guy. So this, this, this could be, this could be, uh, big. Be glad. We could do that. 350 also had co-op where he plays the organization members. That's really cool. I assume you do like missions and stuff. That's really cool. We, we got we got him. We got Be Glad. Let's let's, let's get him in here. Um, let's get him in here. Be Be Glad. Um, replace you. And you're just in reserve. You know, get, get, get him out here too. Why not? Oh, he, oh, he hates that. Oh, he hates it. What about this? What about this? What about some of that? Okay, that's better. He's doing a little jig. Reminds me of the Charmin Bear, and I and I hate that thought immensely. I'm gonna stop rubbing him now. Um, let's go back. Let's actually play the game this time. So, oh, he he's really big. Like he's at, like in in the party, he's big. There he is. Um, so you said Balunra is in the Tron world as Sora. Uh, let me save first. Yeah. I love that animation. Um, I'm currently Riku. Uh, yes. That's, yeah, I did nothing, so that's fine. Whenever I, I, I do plan to play as Sora a little bit, but oh boy. Tell me I don't actually have to do this. Cause I might, uh, shoot. I don't want to advance any story stuff when Cole's not here. Uh, wait, if I, what happened? What if I just die? Wait, what if I just die? I can just die. Kill me! Kill me, Gordon! I wish to be murdered! Hello there. Staring at me. Yes! Kill me! Kill me! I hope this works. I... wait, I... My guy, I'm dying. <laughs> you want to kill me, right? Thank you. The entire Tron, yeah. This game does have a lot of very, very similar looking map layouts as a, as a problem. All right, exit battle. All right, cool. Um, world map. Let's just explore and try and find it. There's the drop point. I may as well do this if it's gonna put me right at the beginning. We'll just go through the whole area and try not to miss a chest. Would it, is that where it would be? Would that be? Would it be like in a chest? Yeah. Faster. Faster. Oh, jeez. I guess. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's what that's for. Yeah. Big rock. Do I have to like yeah. defend it, deflect like it back at him or something? Faster. Uh. Okay. Be closer. Oh, that didn't do much. Here we go. Yeah. 
Oh, it was near the end? In that case, I should probably actually pick a checkpoint closer to the end, and then we'll just work our way backwards. Alright, let's see. Would it be in, like, this area? I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll try and find it. It'd probably be easier if I just looked it up, honestly. So if I get Balloonra, that obviously means I get it for Riku. But, like, will it appear in, like, shops and stuff, too? It's kind of annoying that that's how that works. It's like, oh, it's not a thing unless... Unless you do, uh, unless you explore, which I guess is an incentive to, I thought this would take me down. In the area with lots of crates. All right, I'll try, I'll try and find an area with lots of crates. Yeah. Yeah. Can I go through these? No. Yeah. I literally have to go around. Yeah. We, we missed this chest. Better get that. Yeah. I don't know what we do without oh. shield cookie too. All right. Uh, so cool. There's yeah. literally nothing here, and I can't get through those barriers. So let's let's go back. Uh, yes. Unless that's where I came from, and this is an area where I can't go back. Hop into one of them. It's there. Gotcha. Yeah. I will keep an eye out. If I can get out of this area. Up, 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 uh. Oh, there's some enemies here. Oh, oh, this way. Here we go. Man, I love the movement in this game. It's a shame the game never lets you use it. Cause like I wanna I wanna do that. I wanna do that. But there no no you don't have any walls. You just you just can't. Alright, uh I'll just keep looking around in here, so. Name a better sequel than Shield Cookie 2. I'll wait. Miss this chest. It's really bad form if he ever wants to get in the randomizers of this game. Alright. I. Open the chest. Shield cookie. The original. The classic. We found, we found it. So I couldn't go in any of those. What about over here? I oh. I see. That's just it's not it's gonna take me away from this area. That's cool. I son of you son of a I okay, sorry, please, I'm begging you. Alright, what if I go up here? I, if it will let me, thank you. you. Gotta love how jank some of this geometry is. Right, what if I go up here? Give me a better vantage point at least. It's like a long corridor of crates. Let's see, I'm not seeing anything from up here so far. Uh, let me try going back in here. I mean, if I can't find it in this area, I'll just look it up and it'll be no big deal. Right, yeah, there's, there's no crates in here, and that takes me back to this area. 
And there's oh, there's some some chests down here. Got one of them, but apparently we didn't get the other. I'm just trying to find where it would take me back, because I don't want to go too far. Yeah. I think, okay, yeah, that's up there. All right, uh, we'll look it up. Could flow motion up them in that area. Gotcha. Yeah, let me, let me look it up. Um... Dream drop distance. Balloon rough. Uh huh. From a chest in the solar sailor. Okay, got it. So at least I know what area it's in. So it is, it is back there, which I need to go this way. I can't, okay, got it. I have to, I have to go around. I love how the map just kind of makes everything blend together and makes it really hard for you to see where you're going at times. There's a chest back here. Come on, Sora. Thank you. Lunar Wild Scavenger Hunt. So true. All right, so it's on here. Yes. All right, all right. Oh yeah, 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 this area. Okay, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me, let me check down here first. Okay, yeah, there's no, there's no crates or anything yeah. down here. That's not what I meant to do in the slightest. Just meant to climb up them, thank you. Check behind them. I, that's not what I meant to do, Sora, and you knew that. I, I want to go up. I want to go up. Wait, is this this far high up as I can go? What's up, Cole? Been a while. Yep, it's me. It's really me, Cole, Mr. Mr. Cole Corner. That's me. Uh, welcome to stream. I'm I'm lying, actually. I'm Pat. He doesn't know this, but I'm actually lying. All right, welcome. Welcome to the stream. We're, we're playing some, some Dream Drop Distance. We're trying to find Balloonra, because it's on here somewhere. I just don't know where. Because if we find Balloonra, then I can get back to playing as Riku and progressing the uh, Prankster's Paradise world. That's the uh, that's the main objective we're, we're going for right now. I just, okay, so those aren't doors. Can I go up further? Wait, I wonder if I can go up further. That's, again, not what I meant to do. I wanna go up. It's outside. This area's so confused. Yeah, as cool visually as this area looks, it really likes to just not make things clear on what's an exit, what's like literally anything else. There's like a gap in here. I wonder if I can, I don't think there's anything in that gap. So it's outside. The guide I was looking at literally just said, oh, it's in, oh, I can go this way. It's in a chest on the solar sailor. Wait. Wondrous figment, that's not what it is. Yeah, yeah. And this is the, wait. 
Is this where it just was? No, it isn't. Okay. Oh, I can go up higher. All right, sweet, 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 sweet. Let's do it. This is not where I just was. There we go, now we're outside. All right, uh, now we can just go between these and not have to worry about it. We gotta find some crates. And there's a crate that's open and that has the, the thing we need. Uh, there's nothing in there. Yeah. Oh, this is actually a whole new area. Wait, oh, I don't think I want to be here. Yeah, okay, wait. Did it just put me? Nah, shoot. Nah, shoot. All right, hold on. Wait, no, this is different. This is completely different. Huh? Where'd it put me? I'm so lost. I need to get back outside again. I know that. Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, I just gotta... I just gotta go in these and find... which one of these has an open crate in it. Is the right side? I... can you please just let me not be in hit stun for a thousand years? All right, wait. I I know that I know we're fighting stream delay, but uh, okay, can't go in there. When you say it's here, do you mean like b actually back here? Like down, and then like like over here? Is that what you mean? Like over here? Let me fight some of these enemies real quick. So I don't have to suffer later. We were okay, yeah, that's what I thought. I just wanted to confirm that I literally did exit the level right at the spot where it was. Even though it did was not clear to me that that was a level trigger, but sure. Alright, let's try and get back out. Get back to where we were. Alright, now that's fun at least. Okay, okay. Check these. I can flow motion off this at least. Alright, there's something here. That's not it. It's further. Or am I going backwards? God, I hope I'm not going backwards. I, okay, Sora. Just, just do your thing. Alright, let's not go any further, because it's gonna... I... Never mind! That was the loading trigger. Cool. Alright, and we're back here. Alright. Let's do this one more time. Lose one more time. God dang it. Yeah. Oh. Alright, we can do this. Oh. Go up. Full motion up. I know, I know. Okay, okay, okay. I'm up here. It's not here. You have to keep yeah. going oh. this way. Yeah. And I won't hit the loading trigger this time, I promise. Because I... Alright, guys, I love this game. This game is perfect and flawless. Um, maybe Snake Man... Maybe King Hearts does suck. Oh, you know? Alright, we take care of these guys. And I won't go any further. Just destroy it. Thank you, and let's get rid of this guy too. Is it that chest? Hold on, let me, let me get him. I uh, just dropped. Just get rid of it. I want it. I want it in my life. Thank you. Is it this chest? No, it's candy goggles. 
candy goggles, guys. Okay. Like, there's like a barrier there indicating that like I would have an option to go there, but then it wouldn't let me. So to have the loading trigger earlier is is very disorienting. Okay. Um. Not gonna go in the loading trigger. One of these has a hole in the roof. Okay. Let's. There's a few back here. There's this one right here that has a hole in it. Oh, it's a beak chest. I, Sora, for the love of God, can you please let me have control of the camera? It's a beak chest. There it is. There it is, chat. We found it. God dang it. Why? Why does this game perfect sometimes, you know? You just, you just can't top perfection, and that's an example. All right. So we have Balloonra, thank God. So now we can equip that onto, let me find a save point first. Yeah. Oh. And then we can equip that onto, um, we can equip that onto Riku and then I'll, I'll probably, I'll probably sneakily put a, put a Balloonra and uh, Sora's inventory as well. Just to be like, hey, you should, you should probably use this. Thank God, I know, we did it, we did it, chat. We completed the first arc of the stream. Now we can actually progress. Maybe the bosses won't be as hard anymore. Oh, so I didn't do a lot this week. Um, what did, oh, I can just take the elevator. I, 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 want, I want to attack this guy. Maybe make a save point up here, please. The flick rush arc next? No, we're not we're not doing any more of that. At least for now. Maybe I will off stream. Oh boy, please, 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 please. Please, 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 please. Why do you have so many fires? I, oh my god. It's when okay. It's when the attacks that they're doing against you just make it impossible for you to move. Like, Sora's stun animation, it's true in all Kingdom Hearts games. I feel like it's especially egregious in this one. Sora's stun animation lasts for so long and you have zero control over movement, especially when it's in the air. And when they're just firing the smallest little pellets at you that you can't even see, is 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 not is not a lot of fun. Sorry, that's 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 my rant about this game's combat. Otherwise, it's not bad. I prefer this to Birth by Sleep's combat very much. Maybe I can flow motion off. The, I can't flow motion off the guy. I, okay, do that, do that, and then cure. All right, there we go. Get a couple of balloons up. Oh boy. I just want a save point to open, please. I'm begging. All right, save point. If you die, you, I know, that's why I'm trying to find a save point. Uh, there's one. Don't go away. Don't go away. Don't go away. Thank God. Thank God. There we go. Alright, let's get that on him. Uh, command deck. Edit deck. So many fires, my guy. You don't need this much fire. Uh, balloon row. And then knock him towards enemies. I'll give that a try once it reloads. Snake Mink doesn't have a single balloon in his deck. No wonder that boss is kicking his ass. I know. Well, he had two balloons, but it was mostly fire, which fire's good because it just launches a single projectile at an enemy, but that's just it. It's a single projectile. In Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, you could spam it. Whereas this is why I'm really not a fan of this whole command deck style gameplay. 
I like the way they did it in the numbered Kingdom Hearts games, because you could use moves multiple times, and sure, you had an MP meter, which let you, you know, which put a limit on how much you could do, but, like, you can plan for that. Well, I mean, you can plan for this, too, but, like, the limit is too much, I think. It's, like, there's no way to, like, use a move multiple times unless you have multiple of that move in your deck, which sucks because you want to leave it open for other things, possibly. Take this. But yeah, oh, we can we can do that. That's neat. All right. Navigating the menu on the fly was fun. Well, because it made it easy to do, whereas in this you have to actually take, I mean, unless there is a better way to do it, and we literally haven't found out about it yet, you have to literally take your hand off of the thumbstick that lets your character move and use the D-pad to select it. Whereas at least in Birth by Sleep, it was the uh, the triggers like it was. But here, the triggers... Okay, the left trigger brings you back to the first one in the menu. The right trigger... Right trigger does nothing. <laughs> Uh, and then left, left, well, those are, okay, that's LB and RB. This is left trigger. Brings up that shortcut. And then right trigger does nothing. Why does right trigger do nothing? Anyway, that's my rant. Uh, right, we can, we can drop now. Because we got what we needed. Play Peggle? I mean, I can if you really want me to. Not good at it, but I certainly can. All right, um, how about this? We'll save as Riku. And then we'll, we'll load up, we'll load up Peggle. We'll play, we'll play a bit of Peggle. Next arc's the Peggle arc. This is what we're doing. Because you redeemed it. That's right, chat. If you look at your channel points, you can you can redeem stuff. I wish I could say that about my streams. I want to stream more often. I really do. And I need to stream something that's not game dev. Because I, I, I make a lot of progress when it's game dev. Uh, and it's actually, it's very fulfilling for me. We'll just, uh... Uh, yeah, this one. But uh, if I want to stream more often, I need to stream something other than game dev. I just don't know what to stream yet. Mr. Snakebin would have just scammed us. See, that's what you get when you when you when you go to Twitch.tv/NodeSandwich. Is not not a scam. Just just. Just mediocre content. <laughs> I always love how I um, I always go for the self-deprecating humor when I don't have much else to think about. <laughs> oh, I'll learn to not do that. I'll learn to love myself. All right. Uh... Yeah, I was I was saying earlier I didn't get a lot done this week. I mean I did. I didn't stream a lot, um, but I've been playing through uh, Half Life. Because uh, Colesman wanted me to play through Bioshock for the longest time, and I finally did. And I recently beat Bioshock, and it was a lot of fun. Um, but uh, I wanted to see how that... Because I, I played a little bit of Half-Life, and I enjoyed it. I played a little bit of each episode of Half-Life, but I didn't get really far in any of them. I only got, like, at least past the first chapter. Um... But I just played through Half-Life because I wanted to see how it like compared. And it's it's very interesting. I feel like Bioshock's a lot shorter of a game. And it also has a lot of like very themed levels. So you start off in Bioshock in like the medical pavilion, then you very clearly go to the um the Fontaine Fisheries next, and then that's like a whole themed area. It's all themed around like, you know, the 60s and stuff like that, but they all have their own like little unique gimmicks. And that's true in Half-Life in a sense, 
but it's not so much based on setting as it is based on um, like gameplay mechanics. Which sounds like a bad thing because it, you can have some really bad like gameplay experiences that like take away from the experience. But I didn't really feel that way with Half-Life. I felt like it was able to give me give me a lot of like fun in a lot of different ways, especially in the different like chapters and stuff. Anyway, we played Peggle. We did it. Apparently a crowbar is involved. A crowbar is involved. But, uh, but yeah, Half-Life's more through, like, more... And there's also less, like, story in Half-Life. I won't get into spoilers, but, um... There's, like, way less story. It's very much a thing happened in the beginning, and now you have to go really far to this other place to fix it. That's literally the entire story of Half-Life. Whereas in Bioshock, there's all these different characters you meet, they have different arcs, and a bunch of stuff happens, and there's twists that are, like, you know, complicated. Whereas in, in Half-Life, the story's not really that complicated, but it was still a lot of fun, and I enjoyed it. You can't scam us if there's nothing to redeem. So true. I mean, if I stream more and I do get affiliate, then I have some ideas for, for stuff you can redeem. Uh, I don't want to say yet, in case it actually does happen, but, you know, I, I, got, I got some stuff cooking. But I've seen it look really story lore heavy. That's mostly, I think that's mostly the later games. Because I know, I know some stuff happens in like Half-Life 2 and the episodes. Half-Life 1 was pretty straightforward. Like the original Half-Life. And, like, some stuff happens in the original Half-Life, but it's mostly just one big thing that you have to try and fix. But, yeah. But, yeah, I had a lot of fun. I also felt like the gameplay in Half-Life was a lot harder. I played on both of their versions of the medium difficulty. And... They give you so many more things in Half-Life than they do in Bioshock, like as, turn as far as like weapons and like ammo and stuff. Like I never felt like I was running low on ammo, but to compensate the enemies, they like, the enemies aren't hard, there's just so many of them. There's so many more enemies than there were in Bioshock. But like I, I knew if I, um, like I, I could actually, I could strategically plan out what I wanted to do and where what the best position to be in would be if I don't want to get hit or stuff like that. So it was it was still a lot of fun. Also, I am really running low on health here. I really have to. There's actual hit boxes on those threads. This is not just a visual thing. All right, here we go. Now we got some health. There we go. Older games tend to be harder than modern ones. I mean, yeah, that's true. But like they're both, they're both kind of older games. I know Bioshock came out later. I think Half Life was like mid '90s, I want to say. Whereas Bioshock was like 2006. But like they're they're both they're both pretty hard in there. Oh, I have to get a certain amount of points. Okay. Oh, whoops. I didn't know I had to get a certain amount of points. I, I, how could I be able to see that? But yeah, it was a lot of fun. And now I don't know what I want to play through next. I have to figure that out. Because I really want to play through um, Half-Life 2. But like, I don't want to do a game from a series I just did. Cause like, there's still a lot of games I want to check out. I, I need some of these. I need to forego to help the health. Let's try this. Ugh. Okay, cool. That's still, okay, I, I need a hundred more. Come on. Ugh. Okay, did we, did we do it? Almost. Cool, I died. Bioshock's like Xbox 360, yeah. 
That's what I think. We played it on the um, HD version on the PS5. But yeah. All right, I need to get 700 points. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna dash forward because that's screwed me up before. And I'm not gonna fall for you. Yeah. No. 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 All right. Did it still hurt me even though I attacked it? I could defend, at least. Ugh, I can really only get one of these guys at a time before some obstacles appear. And I'm missing completely. At least I was able to get it still. <laughs> I feel like we're doing a bit better. I, okay, my finger slipped off the thing. All right, we're doing better on health, so we don't need to go for that. We can just pick these up. There we go. Oh, the ring, oh, we did it. We gotta go. Screw your prizes. I, for the love of, please. Just let me go. Just let me do it. Thank you. <laughs> you can shoot Mega Flare with Triangle. Oh, okay, cool. I'll try and remember that for next time. Obtain- wait, obtain Balloonra. Wait. Wait. Could I have done it here too? Well, at least we have two of them. I'm glad we have two of them. <laughs> if that's really the case. It just said obtain Balloonra. Huh, well, what do you know? Oh, we're actually in uh, Monstro. Okay. Pinocchio! Shan! Where have you run off to? Deal or No Deal made a survivor type show? How does that work? This must be. That's, that's very interesting. All right, we got, we got some stuff. Got some high potion. Oh boy. I have a feeling the camera is not gonna be my friend on that one. If I have to do a more complicated version of that later. Uh, it's really, we just wasted so much time. Nah, I mean, at least, it, okay. Actually, as a matter of fact, let me do that. So we should have two of them now, right? Yes, we do. We actually have two of them. So that is actually, we didn't waste time. We, we, we have two of them. That, that can actually come in handy very well. It sucks that you can't, like if you're gonna use the command deck style gameplay, at least make it so I can merge commands and make better ones. Like I don't wanna have to, like now I have all these just regular balloons sitting in my inventory, which I mean, I guess I can sell, but like I won't be able to make them into anything. I just gotta sell them, and then the shop might not have them. Right? You don't even have regular balloon. Like that's a bit annoying. I don't know. Anyway, let's let's pro let's progress. Let me save one more time because I'm picky like that. All right. Uh, we gotta talk to him. Like regular balloons are still really good. Okay. Yeah. I mean, they've What's been the very useful so far. Huh? Goodness, who are you? I'm an anime boy. I'm trying to find my, oh. my darkness or whatever. Oh, poor lad. Seems you were swallowed up by Monstro just like the rest of us. My name is Geppetto, and I'm looking for my son, Pinocchio. Pinocchio's gone missing? I'm afraid so. After all oh my, my gosh, I found him here in Where's the pupils but extending out from his eyes a little bit? That sounds kind of... <laughs> you can actually familiar. see how his pupils are actually like, in Geppetto, front of his eyes. It's very let weird. Let me go look for your son. You would do that? Bosses, but you just Thank balloon you. in their face? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Leave it to me. I'm uh, fine Did you say you Pinocchio. were really going to help us find Pinocchio? Hmm? Oh, it's Jiminy. Jiminy? Was he 
No, you sitting on the bed. Okay. No, I was gonna say. Jiminy Cricket. But shucks, have we met? No. You know, never mind. Uh huh. If you say so. Anyway, Pinocchio comes first. Uh, fine, right. Pinocchio. Any idea where he went? Well, I'm almost certain he wandered off with a stranger. Oh no! Can you describe him? Hmm. I remember oh, that's not suspicious at all. Coat. We certainly don't know who that a could be. Coat? He's back again. He's back. Thanks. Well, I'm going with you. Pinocchio's gonna need his conscience. His and conscience? That's where I come in. Jim and he a dream version. He's here. He's with us. Because remember, kids, in the story and the plot of Kingdom Hearts, uh, this is a dream world, and he he doesn't actually know the real version. So we so we have to explain it with a great great amount of detail in a way that makes sense to you. You understand, children? I just want to run around in Pinocchio. No, you have to understand Kingdom Hearts lore first. All right, let's try. Oh boy, oh, we're running out of health. That's why I can't wait to get into um, the Union Cross lore. I'm still working on that. I I just I can't wait to be like, remember, children, it's all a fairy tale. That's why Ventus is here. All right, and Balloon Ruff, get him. Oh boy. That is a long move to come out that I'm still vulnerable to. So yeah, I might I might keep a cup. What even hit me there? He waved his arms there a little bit and went dead. Just dead. All right, uh, actually, I, no, 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 come on. Let us. Instead of this, put at least one in there. Let's try that. And we'll just keep we'll just tr keep trying to use flow motion. Well, I just realized I got a new keyblade too. I should probably equip that. That'd probably be important. And balloon rope. Yeah, get him. I, are you just, oh, that's my friend. Dang it, I'm, I'm never gonna not confuse my friends for my enemies. It's just, it's always gonna happen. That's cool that it actually does home in on them too. That is very nice. Yeah, get him. I think that might be overkill, but that's fine. I, Riku, come on. Stop, stop proving my point that this is the worst gameplay mechanic. All right, we good? We got them all? Sick. I'm actually gonna reorder this real quick. Wish the enemies had like a red aura. I know, or like your friends had like a like a something, like a blue aura or something. That would be very useful. Okay, so I can select which one I want it to immediately go to whenever I'm like, I yeah, you could do that in Birth by Sleep too. I'm pretty sure. But I just want these cures to be down here, and then we'll have it go to that one when I'm in trouble, or we can have it go to this one. We'll do that. And I need to switch out my Keyblade. Less magic, that's fine. All right, let me save one more time. Cause I, cause I, yeah, boy, do I just love saving. All right, let's, let's progress. I gotta get my cans. I gotta get my channel points. Oh, remember, it's it's just like in Kingdom Hearts 1. It's what it looked like. Oh boy, come on. Please. This, I don't even know how to get out of it. I guess I could just wiggle the stick. Right, 
There we go. That's, that seems to do something. At least you can stun the enemies. I, that I'm thankful for. I don't know what's making me do that, but you can do it, and I'm thankful. <laughs> Uh, there. Get him. Whoppa! Yeah, 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 yeah. Get him. Oh, he's- oh, I'm- I'm getting big sucked. I'm getting sucked. Oh, oh, that- oh, that guy was sucking on me. Okay, got it. Understood. Understood completely. Still over the- I wish they were still called pegs. It was such a good name. No, now they're- now they're cans. Which can- cans make sense. That's fine. But it's not as fun to say as pegs. It's not as fun to tell people to get your cans here. Like, besides this being a very, like, 80s roller rink aesthetic, like, what even is all of this supposed to be, anyway? Is this supposed to be, like, like, cells? Like, vital organs? I mean, it's very aesthetic. Like, I don't even know what it's supposed to be. I know it's supposed to be, like, gross meat innards. But it's very, it's, it's, it's a choice, that's for sure. Oh boy. Oh boy. I've been eaten. Do Be Glad is doing a lot of the effort around here. He does get dazed very easily though. Yo! What up, Killer Brand Flakes? Welcome to the stream. It's just me today. Usually Cole's here too, but he's in Virginia. The one uh, playing the Smashy Bros. But yeah, welcome to stream. They're obviously supposed to be whale insides. Yeah, obviously. Oh boy. Like I get that, but like, like what is it trying to represent? I don't know. It's very, it's a, it's a very interesting aesthetic to use for insides. I, 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 I wish you guys would stop. I wish, I wish I could see what was happening in the game. Let's get talking about Kingdom Hearts. You a Kingdom Hearts fan or do you think these games could be better? I personally am fascinated by the Kingdom Hearts series and playing through them. I enjoyed Kingdom Hearts. I actually did enjoy, like, going back to it, aspects of Kingdom Hearts 1. I really enjoyed Kingdom Hearts 2. And I enjoyed playing through Kingdom Hearts 3. A lot of these side games aren't really hitting me in the same way, though. And I'm not, like, nostalgic for the series, either. Like, I, I never played these games as a kid. I only just started playing them... Around when Kingdom Hearts 3 came out. That's when I started getting into it. So it's very, it's very fascinating seeing all these different games and, like, how they each change up the gameplay a bit. Some for the way worse, some for the way better. Soren Smash is quite annoying. Gotcha. He is very floaty. He's a floaty guy in Smash. So it's very it's very hard to predict his movements. But then again, I, I don't know as much about Smash meta as Cole does, so. I just like me my sword fighter characters in Smash. I feel like they have good moves that you can, you know, space out properly. And you can do some sick combos with them. That's why I like them. But again, I'm, I'm more of a casual Smash player than anything, really. Yeah, 
Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm Pat. Hello. I, um, I stream, uh, Kingdom Hearts with Cole on this channel, uh, every Saturday. But Cole is in Vir Virginia at a Smash event. Um, so, I'm, I'm usually the co-host, but it's just me today. And, um... Right now, I just want to do some level grinding, for the most part. And and try and learn how I can actually get around a lot of these enemies' attacks. So this is where most of my complaints come from from this game. Is how to deal with literally anything that's going on. When... Like, how could I have seen that coming? There's no way I should have been able to see that coming. Okay. I... Come on. Alright, I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. Alright. Oh, it's chasing me. Oh, it's chasing me. I gotta heal. I gotta heal. Ah, yeah, I'm... I'm I'm, I'm denying Cole the experience of playing through these games with me. I know. I'm, I'm, I'm so terrible. Because <laughs> as we all know, Cole just, Cole just loves these games. Oops. Oh boy. I... I could have been able to do something if I wasn't dazed! Okay. It's like, it's not just the fact that I get dazed, it's also just the fact that like, so many moves that these enemies can do to you are like, dazed with different flavors. You know what I mean? Like, you can use gravity, and that's technically not me being dazed, but it's the same effect. I'm just hanging in the air with absolutely zero control of my character. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? I, yeah, it's it's me. I am Cole. Hi, that's me. Alright, hopefully I don't die here, because if I die here, then we lose all that experience we gain. <laughs> Let's start using more of that! Oh boy. Alright, we're already off to a really bad start. At least we can go down here to, like, kind of regroup. Alright, here we go. That up. And let's do... I... I... I, I really do like Balloonra. I hate how long it takes to actually work. Oh boy. Because, like, that's also part of the move. Like, that's not me doing anything. Whereas with just regular Balloon, you could just kind of put them out there and run. Alright, so far so better, at least. Oh boy. That's a big laser that is not coming from one of my friends. I guess I also kind of wish there was more you could do with the flow motion. Which, like, there's... Like, what, what it does give you is very... Very good. But, like... I don't know. Maybe there is a way to do more with it. Like maybe you gotta unlock, you gotta unlock stuff. Cause this game sure loves making you have to unlock things. You have a leaf? Do we? Do I? I honestly don't know. I uh, probably wouldn't be here. Be support. A leaf bracer. There it is. Uh. That's because of uh, one of our one of our balloon kitty guys. We also have second chance too. That's because of Schlump. Nice, big W for Cole for making Schlump and giving us second chance. That is actually really useful. Second chance. Let me just make. Let me just see what specifically it does. Because there's second chance and there's also one more. 
After attack that would otherwise finish you off. Yeah, okay. Got it. Like, at least the move still comes out if you get hit during it, but, like, it just, it takes a while. Oh, you leveled up big lad! Let's go! There's, like, three flow motion attacks in the entire game. Yeah, I want to do more with it! It's such a cool and neat idea. I want, I want to, I want to do more stuff with it. Which it's like, if that's your main gimmick of this game is that you have flow motion and you can do whatever you want, then I feel like you should harp on that more, I feel like. I don't know. I mean, if it was an annoying gimmick, then it would suck, but if, if it's, this gimmick's kind of neat. I like it. Oh, we got more plot. Shout out to Schlump. There he is. We still don't know this dude's name, by the way. The, the organization guy. I mean, I, I know who he is, but I don't think they've revealed it yet. Oh, he's just letting him, he's letting him go. Are you all right? Riku and I look for you everywhere. Uh-huh. I'm just fine. Sorry, Blue means you haven't unlocked it yet? Real bad. You and Father Do I need so to have right Schlump now. in my party Why, in order Pinocchio? to actually I use it? Just might be finally starting to learn. I hope that's not who the case. Are you? Oh, who is he? It's it's me. I'm me, he says. Well, come back. What does that mean? As I live and breathe. Oh my God, that was him. My dark side. Because Riku had a whole arc here in Monstro and Kingdom Hearts since. One, it's just and and took Pinocchio away and was like, oh, I'm darkness and handsome. The seeker of darkness who stole my body. Remember from Kingdom Hearts 1? A puppet replica of the shadows in my heart. And now, I'm facing me. I'm facing me. Gee, Riku, don't you have a Jiminy like I do? He's my conscience. He's taught me all kinds of important stuff. What do you mean by that? What do you mean he's your conscience? Right sure. I've never, I've never seen so these movies, by the way. I'm cool. not a big Disney fan. <laughs> you must have somebody. A in case you're new here. You yeah. Actually, I do. That stupid grin he's always wearing. Yeah? He's the best teacher I could ever have. Gee, he's talking about Sora? I wish I had lots of good friends. You will, Pinocchio. More than you can count. Oh my god. <sighs> what now? I have so many friends. <laughs> Is something in there? Pinocchio, Jiminy, you should head back. I'll see what's shaking things up. Okay. Wait, is this the boss of this world already? These worlds are very short. Oh, he can read about Chain of Memories! Aw, oh, yeah! Anyway, just watch our streams. <laughs> if, if you don't know the lore, just watch our streams. I don't even know if watching our streams of these games will help give you more insight on lore. All right, wait, where? Do I need to go in there? Is that where I came from? You need to buy it with spirit. Oh, got it. Actually, that's not a bad idea. I, you gotta love RPGs with tens of thousands of mechanics. Cause you, you just, you, you gotta love just forgetting that things exist. So, okay. I would have to put Schlump in my party. Um. Let me get out of here real quick. Okay, so abilities. Leaf Bracer, okay. That comes from, it doesn't tell me their names, but it's from one of the Meow Wow guys. Um, so I would have to put him in my party. That's kind of annoying that it just doesn't let you do whatever you want. So I, I can put them there and then ability links and then do that. 
Oh, but because he wasn't in my party, he never got any link points. And he's not even, he's not even, wait, once the spirit's level reaches 10. Oh, and he's, and he's four. Is that what this, is that what that is? I assume, I have to pet him more. I mean, don't get me wrong, I, I, I love petting my little guy. Oh no, he, he doesn't like that apparently. He wants to be poked. He goes up so slowly though, and he has to be level 10? How much do I have to keep poking him? I guess that's what the, the training toys are for, but I don't feel like doing that right now. It's fine. Um, we'll just deal with it, and it might be something I'll promise to do off stream, but never actually will, because I never get around to doing anything off stream when I mean to. Let's go! Uh, wait, I should probably save. It's probably important. <laughs> Point farming arc, let's go. Uh, it's not what I feel like doing today. We got a high potion. High potion, I'm dead. What, oh, what, oh. Oh, oh, we're doing this, are we? So this, uh, so that's what's happening, is it? Okay, cool, 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 neat. Yeah, get him. Oh, baby. And get him. I really need to get some cures going. All right. Wait. Wait, this is where it just was. Wait. Is it? Okay, yeah, that's where that leads. I have to go that way. Okay, got it. Why I sneeze? <laughs> uh, sorry about that. I would have tried to mute the mic, but it's really far away and I can't be bothered. I have to go this way. Ugh, give me one second, I have to stretch. Ugh. You ever have a I, I know no one's gonna relate. But you ever have a really bad sneeze that makes your arms hurt? I don't know why, it's 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 very weird. Alright, we gotta go down here. And then there we go. Sick! We got confetti candy. Well, that's just part of the the boat or whatever. Oh, you can't actually walk in this, it just slowly lowers your health. Okay, gotcha. Uh, we need to get up there. I please... Please work, game mechanics. Oh boy. I... I couldn't see those! Your gimmick is that your visual cues appear on the ground, but when the ground is acid water, I can't see it! I love this game. This game's incredible. This game is perfect and flawless in every way. Alright, let's try that again. Okay, here we go. This is where we can change it. All right, perfect. I feel like another thing too is, I feel like I would genuinely, and I feel like Cole would probably genuinely enjoy these games more if we actually were playing on a lower difficulty. Besides proud mode every time. I never put it in him that he had to play on proud mode. Cause like, 
all these Kingdom Hearts streams were partly influenced by me, but like... I never said that you had to play every one of these games on Proud Mode. <laughs> Alright, we can go in here. Uh, sure, I guess that worked. Uh, then we can... I... That's not where I meant to attack. I didn't even know there was enemies back there. Oh my god. Get him. And cure, please. For the love of God. He counterpicked you to the acid water. I know. We gotta, we gotta ban the acid water stage next time. It's absolutely unfair for the meta. Yeah, get him. All right, there was a chest in here. It's a big chest. Yeah. We got collision magnet. What is that? Collision magnet. Pull in an enemy and then launch it towards the other foes. That could be useful. I'll try that. Alright, we need to go in here. Oh yeah, no, 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 that, this doesn't look like a big boss arena where we might need to fight a huge enemy and maybe play with the inverting gravity mechanic to, you know, get around his, his gameplay gimmick. Yeah, no, 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 this is just a, a normal big ginormous open room. Oh, it's fine. Surely nothing will happen here. How was I able to literally do anything out of that? I know I keep saying that, but I'm sorry, but it's true. I, I can go up, I can go up here. Oh, there's like little, I, I, please don't stun lock me. Please don't actually stun lock me. Oh my God. You shouldn't be able to do that! Ah. Okay. All right, let's 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 think this through. Let's figure this out. We gotta get to the other end of the room. What if I just do this? What if I just do this? What if I just don't even worry about it? What if I just do that? No, what if I do this? Thank you. <laughs> okay. That didn't flip the gravity, that just made all these platforms rise up. Okay, okay, Riku, I'm gonna need to ask you to go in this direction, please. Thank you. Thank you. And then from here, we can do this. Go up here as a panic button when you're getting com wombo comboed. I, I could probably use that more. The only problem is, unless the enemies are big, the only way I can really use flow motion when I'm just kind of standing like this is I can flow motion off the enemy by like dashing into it and then doing that big spin around it move and then, you know, throw it. Or I need to be near a wall with which I can do that. So like, yeah, flow motion's actually not a bad way to like, especially if you can just like do that, to just get above them all and just not even worry about it. But like the problem is you need a wall. And if there's no walls or there's just like a tiny little hand railing, then that can make things a bit more difficult. Unless there's a, something I'm not sure of. Cause it's not like you can use full motion to just dash out of the way. Like you, you need to bounce off a wall in order to activate it. So like I could do, well, I could do this and then go over there. And then I was going to say, do a big finishing move on him, but you know, I could do that. 
I can just literally have it scripted towards it. Oh boy. Alright, well I actually blocked that. That's good at least. Get it. Let's get it. Flow motion slam move is really good to separate them. Yeah, if there's at least one big enemy, I could I could just dash into them like that and just slam them around. That is a good move. I do like using that a lot. Oh, whoops. I want to get up here, please, and thank you. There we go. Oh, I'm about to drop soon. That's cool. Um, I didn't even realize that until now. I need to go this way. How far can we complete this world before I need to drop? Let's find out. All right, actually, you know what? Uh, drop here. Because I do want to actually fight some of these enemies and, you know, gain experience and stuff. That's going to be very important. <clears throat> I don't want to have to keep running past them all the time. And also, I should probably get Sora out of, out of Tron World. Just to get Cole back to where he was. Uh, we were here, I think. That is the... That's not what I meant at all. Uh... Ready, set, nope. I, okay, let me pause it. Thank you. World map. Play Peggle? I just played Peggle. I thought that was a one-time redeem. Uh, what time is it? Oh, time went, time went by pretty quickly, actually. It is already 11.30. I did not even realize that. Um, well, okay then. Here's, here's what I'll do. I'll put Sora here. I'll drop. And we can say we made some good progress with Riku, right? Because Riku's here. I should, you know what? I should at least try and find a save point. And then we'll, we'll go a little bit over time to play some Peggle. If I can find a save point. So I owe you one peggle before the stream ends. And 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 we'll do it. Oh boy. Either if I can find a save point or if I die, one of the two, and it seemed like the latter is the most likely. <laughs> Alright, let me just go back. Wait, unless. No, okay, there's no save point there. Let me go back. I need to... Oh, I have to actually navigate through this again. God dang it. Alright, let me navigate through you, and then we'll, we'll, we'll find a save point. Uh, there was one in here, right? I think. There's one back here, I'm pretty sure. If we have to go all the way back, I will. all dead ends. That's not the direction I want to go in, Riku. I guess I just literally have to go this way. There's actually more of this area than I thought. Huh. Alright, I'm pretty sure there's a um, save point back here. Yeah, here we go. I have to take out the enemies first. Back to take out the trash. How we doing? Still playing. <laughs> I want to say, hopefully we got to the halfway point of this world. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, yeah, get him. Yeah, get him. Do it. 
Get him. You can do it. Do it. Yeah, get him. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can do it. You are really not doing that much damage to him, are you? All right, here, I'll, I'll, I'll help you out. All right, now, now get him. Now finish him. Now get him. He's stunned. He can't do anything. Sorry to hear. I know. It's, it's regrettable. But it is what it is. All right, come on. Come on. I believe in you. I believe in you. Yeah. Good job. Good job. You did it. Yeah. And now he's, now he's EP. Now he's a little EP. Oh, he's, he's winding up for a big pop. That's weird. That's a weird move. I have to get used to that. No! Not with your lasers! No! Please! Let me move! Let me move the character! Thank you! Thank you, thank you! Alright, yeah, now get him! Alright, 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 alright. Oh, uh, that just killed him because there were no enemies left. Uh, cool. All right. Let's save. Nope. Let's save. And we will end it here. But not before we play some Peggle. But yeah, um... I don't know what else to say besides what I already said about this game. Just, I like the fact that they brought back the Kingdom Hearts 2, like... The character is weirdly more controllable in this game than he was in Birth by Sleep. But, um... It's, it's still, it's still a lot. It's, it's when... My, my main issue and the reason why I'm having so much trouble with the combat... Is, I mean, I mentioned I mentioned it before. It's the fact that there's just like it's there's there's so many moves that just make your character stunned or just unable to move. And even just normal basic attacks from enemies make your character just stand in place for like an infinitely long time before you're able to move your character and actually get him out of the situation he's in. So there's no, like, sh and because you can't see what attacks the enemies are doing because they're so clustered and in your face, it's like, it, it just makes it, it just makes it so that you just don't know what you can do about the situation. I don't know. That's my thoughts. And I know Kingdom Hearts 2 has the exact same problem, but I feel like in Kingdom Hearts 2's case, a lot more manageable like the the enemy clusters were more like you can you can tell what kind of enemies they were and what they can do to you like there was a finite amount of enemies that you could be like all right this guy's just gonna do melee attacks against me so i can stand back and hit him with projectiles or like this guy's gonna shoot a bunch of projectiles at me so i can just use reflect and and get him that way like, there's clear ways for you to manage all these enemies. It's just in this game, like, sure, it's very easy to tell what the kinds of enemies are, but they're so diverse that it's just like... It's just like, it's hard to keep track of it all, I guess. I don't know. That's my thoughts. That's probably, that's like the main reason why I'm having so much difficulty with this game, I think. I just gotta get this last one. Yeah, let's go. Let's get it. Getting zero to death from stun locks happens weirdly often in Dream Bout. Yeah. It's like... And again, I keep mentioning it's a problem that all Kingdom Hearts games have. I feel like it was really egregious in Birth by Sleep. I didn't think it could get more egregious, but I feel like this game is incredibly egregious with the whole getting stun locked thing. It's... It's so annoying. Anyway. Thank you all for watching. Otherwise, I am having fun. This game is, so far, more enjoyable to play than 
uh, Birth by Sleep, in my opinion. Um, and I know if I interact with its like gameplay mechanics more, I'll probably have a better time and you know, you know all that. Uh, but yeah, anyway, that's my rant. Thanks for watching. Uh, how many viewers we got? I mean, I wouldn't know who to rate anyway, so I'll probably just end it. Thank you all for watching. Um, next week, Cole should be back. So, um, yeah. We'll play through more, more, more Kingdom Heart. Otherwise, I think Cole is just doing Smash on Monday and Wednesday. Um, more, more Duck Hunt Dog Days. So, uh, so yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, go to twitch.tv slash node sandwich if you want some of my streams. I don't have a stream schedule. That's why you gotta follow me. That's why you gotta hit that follow button so you know when I go live. Cause I'm, I'm, I'm an enigma. I'm a mystery. Um, but yeah, twitch.tv slash node sandwich. That's me. Uh, anyway, I'll stop shilling now. Anyway, take care. Have a good one.